it's your girl Yana, and I'm back with another video. So guys, as you can see, I'm going to down below. I'm going to be doing like a quick mini Q&A because I didn't get a lot of questions. And I'm putting in like clips and snippets of the parade that was just happening on my campus the other day. And what else I might include? I think that's it. Or if you see something else, I decided to put it in last minute. <laughs> But anywho, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. Make sure you comment down below different video ideas or topics you want me to talk about. And I definitely will do it. And yeah, let's just get right into the okay. So, I'm going to start it off with the Q&A. I typed the little questions or whatever I got from Instagram. I'm going to Google it because I record my, my phone. So, I wasn't able to. Yeah, you get what I'm talking about. Anywho. The first question was, <clears throat> how are you balancing school? Okay. So, yeah, I think I'm balancing school very well. Um, I have, like, I'm looking at it right now. I have, like, this big old calendar on my wall or whatever in my dorm. And I literally list out everything on Saturdays or Sundays or what I got to do for that next week. So, I can go ahead and have it all laid out. I don't got no excuses, so I know what I gotta do on what day and when it's supposed to be due. Da, 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 da. And what you mean by balancing it like with friends and stuff, I would say I balance it pretty good because at the end of the day, my school work gonna come first, so I mean, I'm not gonna do nothing until my work is done. But like, I feel like I still, we go true. We be having like little movie nights on campus, we have like love events and stuff I, I still get out and do things it's not like i'm just cooped up in the room or whatever but yeah it's not much since covid came so there's not much you can do and with family i love y'all i've been home a lot like the this is the longest i've ever stayed on campus since i've been like been at school like i've been at school now without going back home for two weeks like this week that's coming up and make two weeks so I go back home Friday because I know my family not used to it. They say they don't miss me. But yeah. I've been in my dorm two weeks now. I'm proud of myself. They ain't go back home. Like, I'm really proud. Like, today I was supposed to go to the museum. Sucks. Because COVID, they not open to the public. I really wanted to go to the museum. They got like a little museum down here where I was still it's closed. So I just grabbed me something to eat and me and my roommate played ping pong and I was there for like an hour. It was so fun, but I got a little tired. Ping pong is tiring. I did not know ping pong that tiring. But yeah, I done tried a lot since I got to college. Like I done tried pool and ping pong. It's two games I've never played before and it's fun. Try that. Don't knock it till you try it. Period. Next question is, how are you managing your business? <sighs> Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. It gets stressful. Like I really have to. Whenever I go home, I think I make sure I put some time toward my business. If it's not nothing but promoting, if it's making more product, if it's ordering inventory, like I try to do something related to my business when I go home. And then of course you have to make time for your loved ones. So it's kind of hard when you're trying to manage everything. But I think I do pretty good. Um, right now, I'm just trying to better my marketing and advertising skills. I'm trying to get my business out there more, trying to find different, you know, what's the word? I don't know, areas, I guess, for my business. Um, I have a pop-up shop that I will be attending on October 24th. It'll be at the Hilton. But yeah, yeah, it's just a lot when it comes to my business it can be very stressful because it's like it's not gonna all come to you just like that you know it takes time it takes it's a process and that's just gonna come to you like that it's, you gotta work for it you know that's something i learned in life like ain't nothing gonna just come you gotta work for it you gotta grind for it you gotta hustle for it and that's what i do like i just try to keep my mind on straight and don't try to dwell on it too much like if i see myself going negative i try to watch something positive or I try to I listen to some gospel or anything and get my mind off of it or I just talk to my mom or grandma about it and be like girl I don't got nothing stress about it I don't know I just get back in my good spirits but I'm not gonna lie 
I get to thinking real hard and it can come stressful sometimes where your girl be coming back up like I don't sit and dwell on too much I have to get myself back up you know because it's nothing but up from here like up up okay up next is how school one school one good like my grades are great stats killer okay killer hate stats hate it could it could it But I'm hanging in there with stats, like, sex. I just go with the flow with stats, like, for I'm not even, I just don't make my mind, I'm not even feeling stressed. I don't, I don't got time to put my body through that, like, I'm not even feeling stressed on this. Like, I'm feeling go with the flow, keep it in God's hand, you know, and just do my best. That's all I can do at this point. I don't learn to stop all this stress, like, who got time for that? Who got time for that? Not me. Not me, I don't have time for that. Yeah, yeah, this how school going. But all my other classes, love my favorite class. It's honestly Like y'all lit, I love me some lit. Like lit always been my favorite subject. Like, bro, I'm reading. Sorry, <laughs> going to a little school detail, but yeah, I did not read this much until school started back. I've read like four books, so it's my fourth one. And it's the mom. Uh, Pretty sure you don't watch the movie. It's called The Hate You Give. The book is awesome. You should read the book. You should read the book. I'm almost done. Literally halfway to it now. It's good. I'll be done by the end of the week because I have to be scheduled to be done this week. So I have to be done with it. So I'll be done with it by Tuesday because I have scheduled pages that I have to read. Start tomorrow. So yeah, I'll be done by Tuesday. But you need to read this book. Period. Anywho. Yeah, that's how school's going. Favorite subject, lead. Love it because we read such powerful books and it to be touching it. Like, that's my favorite class. My next favorite class is um, Honors Human Communication. That class right there, so dope. Like, we talk about things, it just basically help you communicate. Basically, if you're in college and you need to learn how to communicate, that's a great class. Like, um, it's a great class. I'm a little scared because I gotta do a speech for my final exam in front of everybody. Like, I'm not ready for it, y'all. I'm scared. Like, I'm so, so good. I be always overthinking this type of stuff. Anytime I come to speeches, I always want to think. But for that final exam, I'm just going with the flow. I'm not even going to stress myself about it. Don't look for real life. For real. I'm just picking a topic that, you know, that I feel hard about. So that when I'm speaking about it, I have more to talk about. And it won't be hard for me to get time in. We got to speak five minutes, y'all. Five get ready for this is college for you or this is college for you like or it's college for you but anywho other than speech i like the class um my next favorite i say my finance class then the next favorite will be american government then the next favorite will be stats hate stats Ugh. but yeah that's it on to the next question how's college going that's kind of the same question is how's school going i guess um college straight i like college i mean ain't that you, nothing much you can do i mean i ain't gonna say it's nothing much because people still be going out they don't care people still go out but me personally i don't all the places i go to the mall to the store <laughs> like today i was gonna go to the museum but it was closed like i do cute little stuff like that i don't be partying i mean partying I don't be doing that. Um, but it's some people do. They be having clothes still pop They be having kit that still pop out. I mean, hey, it's up to you. Just go and be safe, you know? And leave it up. But yeah, I know. I go to the, to the little cute events they be having. They be having movie nights. They be having DIYs. But I haven't went to a DIY yet. Um, next week, they got a escape room that we have to do. Definitely going to there. I'm excited for that. Um, what else they got? Um, they just be having little events and stuff. They try to make sure you involved in stuff and get you engaged or whatever so i try to do little things i ain't gonna care i'm gonna do everything i'm just being real but yeah that's it so y'all that's um really all the questions i got that's all the questions i got 
So yeah, that's it, y'all. That's my update on how it's been. My, I've been great. I've been working out every day. I work out Monday through Friday. This past Friday, I do just cause. But yeah, I work out Monday through Friday. I always work out. I have to get it in. Period. Um. I feel like I've been eating up here. Like, I, ain't gonna lie. I still be eating bread though, no cow. Like, bread, y'all, it's like hard. How are you not gonna eat bread? Bread is like like sandwiches. I ain't gonna eat no meat and cheese. Like, I just ate this and I ate a, um, a ham and cheese sandwich, like, with some sun chips. Cause, like, wait, how are you not gonna eat bread? Like, come on now. And then it's noodles. They wanna say noodles are good for you. Cause I got too much sodium. And that's true, but I still eat noodles. I just don't eat it every single day. Now, if you eat noodles every single day, they can't be unhealthy for you because of the sodium. So I try to maybe eat like once a week. But yeah, guys, oh, this video 11 minutes. I could just be talking, but anywho, go follow me. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe for more videos. Like I said, I will insert clips from the parade, so stay tuned to the next clip if you want to see what was going on at the the parade. It wasn't much, but hey, I guess they wanted to do a little song, but you can check it out if you want, so there you go. Oh, Where's Layla? I can't find her. <laughs>